Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're good. So today's video now, you've probably already seen the title, so you know what's gonna happen, you know what's gonna go down. So before we get into the video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up, that'll be awesome. And don't forget to subscribe. Um, some of you that do, who know or don't know, I used to do bodybuilding, I still do, but I started doing some CrossFit and I went to a big CrossFit competition this weekend in Dubai and uh, I left feeling uh, some type of way and I thought that I needed to sit down and talk about it and uh, this video is just to talk about what my issue is with CrossFit and the problems I have with CrossFit um, and seeing that I just went to an event we'll start with the CrossFit athletes um, the athletes all look like they don't lift I mean look at them Look at the athletes, look at the men, look at the women. Uh, they look like they don't know how to bicep curl. They look like they don't know how to shoulder press. I mean, who cares if you can snatch 115, 120 kilos? Who cares if you can clean and jerk 140, 150 kilos? Who's impressed by that? Who cares if you can handstand walk and you can do loads of ring muscle ups and toaster bars and bar muscle ups? I mean, you need to be in the gym doing some glute kickbacks and glute bridges and some bicep curls, you know, make them gains. That's all that matters. The only thing that matters is looking aesthetic. And these athletes, they don't. They're just strong and mobile and they can do loads of gymnastics. Um, I mean, and Olympic lifting, who cares about that, you know? And that brings me to my second point, the diversity in the training, the various training modalities in CrossFit is why I feel CrossFit sucks. I mean, why do you need to be able to do Olympic lifting and then gymnastics, aerobic training, endurance training, running, cycling, swimming? I mean, who cares, who cares about that? Why do you need to learn new skills? Why can't you just stick to one thing? In my opinion, bodybuilding is the only way to be fit. All you need is big biceps, big chest and a big leg. Who cares if you run out of breath when you walk up the stairs or you run, you can't even run a mile without getting out of breath. What's the point in learning new things? It's, it just makes your life more difficult and makes it harder. And why would you want to learn new skills? And that's what really makes me annoyed with CrossFit and why I feel CrossFit really sucks. And another reason why CrossFit sucks is it makes me feel insecure. It makes me feel like just doing one form of training isn't good enough and why should I have to learn new things? Why are they so good at doing all these other things? Why can't they just stick to one thing? And that makes me feel insecure. I don't want to change, I want them to change. I want them to stick to one thing. If you want to do Olympic lifting, stick to Olympic lifting. If you want to do gymnastics, stick to gymnastics. Why do you have to learn so many new skills and make me feel bad about myself. And that's another reason why I feel CrossFit sucks. Now, one thing that happened over this weekend with uh, some of the athletes uh, on the competition floor, uh, and this has happened in other competitions as well, is one of the main reasons why I really loathe CrossFit. And this video right here, as you can see, this guy is called David Shurunke, and he's just finished the event and then he's gone back to Zach to encourage him and motivate him to finish. Now, what the hell is that? Does he not know that showing camaraderie is weak and lame? Like, you're supposed to be happy he's doing badly. You're supposed to be feeling better about yourself because you've won. Why are you showing compassion and you cheering him up and you're showing support? That's so pathetic. You know, you should be happy that he's doing badly. I've seen this a few times with CrossFit competitors and I'm just like, who does that? You're encouraging each other, that's pathetic. You're supposed to be happy that your opponent is doing badly. What is that all about? And don't even get me started on the community. I mean, why are people who train at the same box having barbecues and events and, you know, having birthday work, workouts and things like that. I mean, don't they realize that you're supposed to go to the gym by yourself, put your headphones on and don't talk to anyone. 
And what's all this high-fiving each other at the end of a workout and partner workouts? I don't get that. Who wants that? Why are you always smiling after a workout? I don't understand this whole community and being happy and smiling and talking to each other. You're not supposed to do that. That's not how fitness works. I mean, it's, it's just ridiculous. I mean, am I the only one that feels like this is ridiculous? I feel like you're supposed to be on your own. Don't talk to anyone. No one talks to you. No community, community spirit. You're supposed to be on your own, doing your own thing. And again, don't even get me started on the open workouts. The open workouts where people encourage each other to do well. You're supposed to be hoping that they do badly and you're encouraging people and the whole box is there clapping and whooping and oh man, what? I don't understand that. This is probably one of the biggest things that makes me realize how much CrossFit sucks is how much everyone encourages each other. That just doesn't make any sense. In conclusion, the main reasons why I think CrossFit sucks is it pushes you harder than you've ever done before. It makes you learn new and different types of training modalities. And it also pushes you mentally and physically harder than you've ever done since you started training. And honestly, all these things is why, in my opinion, I feel CrossFit sucks. I started doing CrossFit almost two years ago and I absolutely love it. And I guess I am probably one of those suckers. Um, I've been mixing CrossFit and bodybuilding. I still do bodybuilding. And I love every aspect of CrossFit. My time in Dubai has made me realize how much I really love CrossFit and the community and how it pushes you and makes you learn new things, how it makes you hate your life, but at the same time, you absolutely can't wait to do it all over again. How it makes you feel like, yeah, okay, you've learned this, but then there's more to learn. You're always learning. It's never done. It's never enough. You can always do more. You can always push harder. And I've met some amazing people because of it. So yeah, CrossFit does suck. And all the things I listed are probably the main reasons why I love CrossFit as much as I do bodybuilding. And I wouldn't want it any other way. So yeah. Thank you for watching the video. Peace out.